Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, today we're gonna be talking about how to make simple collection view in Swift just in a few minutes and we will use, uh, you know, pretty uh, easy, actually ready to go Xcode uh, tools. And also you need to know there's a link to source code in the comments. And yeah, let's start and here you'll see will be our output just uh, you know collection view with uh, just opposite colors one by one and yeah let's start a project so file new project yes single view app and so rename it iOS Swift UI Collection view. Here you go. Oh no. Yeah, your collection view. Uh, it already exists. I'm gonna replace it. It's supposed to be a very short uh, tutorial, just uh, to get idea how to remove um, view controller, how to remove, uh, you know. default uh, view uh, in a storyboard and replace it with something new yeah here you go uh, we will go to our storyboard and we will select our this yellow button and this view uh, you go you, even you can uh, select this one and uh, tap on delete then it's gone so I'll go here and uh, uh, if you type color is col, then uh, you will have collection view control. You can just drop one of them here. And the only things you need to do, you need to go here and make sure uh, it is initial view controller for you. And uh, also, yeah, we need to right click here and it's our view control controller and delete that one. Make sure to move it to trash. And uh, yeah, here we can uh, now create a view controller for our view controller. So uh, just select, uh, make sure to you are in right place. Then tap file, toggle attach. Here choose UI control view as a uh, super class, and so it is going to be subclass of this, and then next yes I'm gonna use same name so it's almost done uh, the only things uh, remain I can go to main storyboard and select myself in identifier I need to type self like this uh, to uh, you know give it idea that which is an identifier then I go to collection view controller I don't need to do any connection like control drag or whatever it's already connected and uh, yes so I'll come say number of sections one number of uh, item in section I say hundred okay uh, here I just need uh, one more variable this uh, variable I name it variable so color okay I just say yes by default put it true You'll see that what is useful, uh, how it's worked for me. Here, when I'm, I'm supposed to connect, you know, config my cell, I just uh, I say, okay, my cell background. Yeah, cell background color equal, okay, what? So I just say, okay, look at that pointer that I made if it's true make it red if it's false make it blue uh, 
Okay. Now I just say, okay, after you did that, make it opposite. So cell color equal opposite. So, okay. so next one gonna be, uh, you know, opposite. Okay, uh, so I will, uh, I will be almost done, ready to go, but before that, I want to make sure. So I'll go to my story where I s select my collection view and make sure, yes, it's not uh, that one. So uh, you need to make sure to select this one and uh, to be a controller for you. And uh, yes, uh, let's run it to see how it will be our output. It goes to run it in uh, iPhone XR. It's gonna make it very slow, so I'll go to iPhone 8 Plus. Also, you can go to product and see how, how much it's made it still for me. So I select this one and I'm gonna close it. Okay, so now I have iPhone 8 Plus already open, so that's why I try to run it on iPhone 8 Plus. So uh, yes, here we go. Uh, start to install it over my simulator, and uh, yes, here we go. We have it. You see how quickly we could make it. You know, one output. Uh, you know, UI collection view. And uh, yeah, that's it for today. I hope you like it. If you like it, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to be subscribed for more video. If you have any questions, please ask in comment. I'll be more than happy to help. I wish the best for you and have a good one. Bye bye.